What's up, everybody? It's the homie Truth Teller, the street reporter, and a lot of people always say truth. Can you get us somebody from Chicago who a lot of people might not know, but a lot of people know? Today, I think I hit that on the head. I'm telling y'all, this is going to be a classic interview. This is one of the most requested yeah, interviews I get in my DM. How Please you doing, Miss Tay? How you doing, Truth? Man, I'm chilling. Now, for the people who don't know exactly what's going on, you'll let them know exactly what's your name and where you're from. My name Tay Got the Jews, and I'm from the O Parkway Gardens. Mm, most definitely. Like eight has. Parkway Gardens. That's the O Block. That's the block we all see on the internet. Mm -hmm. The place they make blogs about this shit. Mm -hmm. How was it growing up as a female in Parkway Gardens? She was fun. We used to have so much fucking fun, especially in school. That's where I met everybody at school. We all went to dying and shit together. Oh, that's the school that all the rappers went to, right? Mm -hmm. Everybody went though. Okay, right. Everybody. But okay. she was fun though. She started getting crazy. She started getting dangerous. Right. Shit ain't fun to me no more though. Right. I'll be chilling. Right. Um, did you see some of the things we see? You know, I ain't in Chicago anymore, but do you see some of the things that I see that they talk about your community or are you known to it or it kind of overhype that area or something? I be seeing everything they be saying, mm -hmm. but I'm numb to that shit now. At first, that shit used to get to me. I used to be, well, this hell. <laughs> that shit used to be making me mad to say, I ain't gonna lie, but I'm numb now to it. That shit don't bother me though. You know, they make it seem like all the old black people aggressive, you know. It's dangerous, you know. Uh, don't go past there. They beating people. They shooting people. You think y'all get a bad name out there? Yeah, because that ain't all what it's about. Like, right. you come over there, you're going to have fun. All that shit, that shit just be internet shit. Like, it's fun over there. We be having giveaways. Horses be coming through that bitch. <laughs> we be doing all types of shit. It just be, it ain't it ain't what it's seen on the internet though. It ain't all like that. Right. Can you kind of me is crazy though, but it ain't what they make it seem. Right. Can you kind of give me a quick look at like what was pre O Block before the rap shit? Was it how it is now? Was it different? Because somebody told me before the rap, it was like everybody was all hanging out and shit together before. Shit got bad. Everybody was. It was fun. Like it wasn't nothing to worry about. Like you ain't have to look over your shoulder, worry about if a motherfucker gonna back you. Right. None of that shit. Like one, none of that going on. We was able to do what we want to do. Go, we want to go. All that shit. Shit. <laughs> shit went bad fast. Like. Was it the rap shit? Like the rap disses and things like that. No. A lot of, a that lot of shit people. came later. Oh yeah. That shit, shit came later. On. Shit started from a fucking... From what I've seen, it started from a basketball game and diet. Shit just went left after that. Basketball game, they lost. We won a game. Shit like that. Shit just went left. Motherfuckers yep. was getting jumped on at school. Had to be at school at a certain time. You get caught, you get away and jumped on. That shit was back and forth. So that was real. Yeah, mm. that shit was real. Yeah, I want to ask you something though. You know, I kind of want to jump right into this. I don't want to front. You know, they know you on True Teller TV. I kind of want to jump right in this because I got a list of questions. I kind of want to jump right into. This. Mm -hmm. Um, the fans tell me you related to T. Roy and H. K. Nah, we ain't related. I used to go with T. Roy though. Okay, so it was, is a connection. Yeah. That was my boyfriend for like six, seven years. But I've known him for a long time, though. Mm -hmm. He went to diet. Right. I'm going to ask you a question about him, though. since Because when I look at your Instagram, the fans kind of alerted me to your Instagram. And that's a lot of people, you know, who post their life and memories on Instagram, right? Your Instagram kind of look like a museum, okay? It got like a lot of rare pictures and shit all on your Instagram. To be honest with you, I believe, you know, college kids and 
rap catch up and a lot of sites took pictures from you and kind of went viral. You believe the same thing? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, I seen a lot of my pictures on their pages and shit going viral. Damn, that's my picture. Right. I should have fucking watermarked my shit or something. <laughs> right. But shit, it is what it is. So when you having all those pictures on your Instagram, um, I kind of want to ask you these questions. How was it seeing like some of that shit jumping off? Because there's been a lot of passes, a lot of death with a lot of those guys that's been on your Instagram. How was it from a female watching all that shit jumping off? Shit was just, it was scary at a certain point. Shit was just crazy. Like, it was unbelievable. Shit was just happening back to back to back to back. Mm. Not just from Parkway, 600. Blackgate, my block, like all where I was at. I was all up at the parkway. I was on 600. Blackgate. Mm. You got a lot of pictures with 600 and mm -hmm. all them on there. And you knew those guys. You know, a lot of guys that's in those pictures. You know, it wasn't weird just watching a lot of those guys just passing away like that. Yes. Yeah. Shit was crazy. You get numb to it, mm -hmm. PTSD and shit like that from all that. Shit fucked up. Shit have fucked you up for real mentally if you let it though. You just gotta be strong. You gotta keep going. You can't. <laughs> can't keep do. You can't dwell on shit. Shit. Mm. We can't change shit. We know what come with this shit. Everybody know what come with it. Mm. You also knew HK too. Yeah, that was mm. my brother. Mm. He was locked in. You know, I see a lot of blogs and stuff about him on the internet. You know, the internet like to paint pictures of people a certain way, right? Mm -hmm. I want to ask you, can you paint me a picture of him? I know he had a different side. Not saying that's how he was, how they painted it, but I'm pretty sure he had some laughable moments. Yes, HK was funny as hell. He was nice, though. Yeah. He was nice. He was quiet, but around people that he knew, you had to know him to know, like, <laughs> um, like, like, as he Roy was. Everybody um, look at him like... A certain way. He won. Had everybody look at him like. He was crazy though. He was one of the ones. He ain't get no fuck what he said. <laughs> he ain't get no fuck. If he ain't like you, he gonna tell you. Tell you, you know, you got a face <laughs> card now. You be rapping. Mm -hmm. A lot of the people who people consider the famous old black people be all on your Instagram, all in your videos. Mm -hmm. You know, seem like everybody supporting you. Mm -hmm. Is it dangerous for you? Man, is it dangerous for the females now? Or y'all don't look at it like shit like that on their wall? Bro? Like, you still looking at shit like, hold up, I'm gonna look now. I used to. Right. I ain't gonna lie, I used to be. Didn't want to go certain places and shit. Right. Like, scared, like, you know. Because you're in a lot of famous pictures, too. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but now I just be, I don't get no fuck. Because mm. I'm protected everywhere I go anyway, so. Mm. Either me or you. <laughs> I want to know that though, because there's a lot of For females real. out there though in O Block. Yeah. You know? It's a lot of mothers. And but we don't be with that shit though. Right. We be trying to get us some money. We ain't, right. we ain't with none of that gang banging shit. We used to though. I ain't gonna lie. Hard as fuck. Right. But that Hard. shit did reach the females. Yes. Right. We we slow down though. Shit start getting for real. We right. feel back. <laughs> Uh-uh. And you know why I asked you that, though, Tay? Why? It's because you got a picture that I think is a, a picture I've seen from all the blog sites. Which one? Okay, it's on your Instagram. And I'm going to tell you what this picture is. Okay? You got a picture that's been posted by all the blog sites of a young D. Rose. Oh, yeah. Okay? You knew D. Rose very, very young. Very, very young. Mm -hmm. when he was still in high school. Me and D Rose like this. We locked in though. Mm. We, yeah. <laughs> I find that amazing. The reason I, you know, and I don't want to make this an interview Pretty about just asking too. you about people, but you know, your Instagram. You know, the fans told the truth. Go to take out Ju's Instagram. She got like a museum, you know. Yes. They say you got all the classic shit, so it seemed like, you know. And another thing I want to ask you about that though is, you know, um, as a female, out there though, seeing that shit out there, you know. But I ain't gonna lie, the internet makes it portray that area dangerous, aggressive. You know, 
What caused all that shit from a female point of view? Why is all the killing spiking in Chicago like that, you know? You got rapping, a point of view on that? When that shit started, when rapping started, when motherfuckers started rapping, that shit just... It fucked, it started fucking with everybody. Like, you say rapping? Yeah, I feel like when everybody started rapping, that's what shit started getting. Because motherfuckers put people names in songs, you know? Mm. Doing all type of shit. People feel some type of way. You think rapping sparking, like extra sparking and mm -hmm. shit? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I want to know that. What about Keith? You know Keith. Yeah. Mm. I see you got a picture of a young Keith too on your That's page. my boy. Yeah, that's crazy. I talked to him probably like two years ago. Oh, yeah, Keith. Oh, that's dope. Yeah. Let me ask you a few questions about Keith. <laughs> How was Keith? What what was the pre-rich Keith? You know, what was the before the fame Chief Keith like? Was he like the stories they tell about him? You know, gorilla, savage, or yeah, he, he was, was a good dude. He was. He was just like everybody else. Mm -hmm. He was like everybody else growing up. He just, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. He was always into that rap shit, though? Yeah, he was. Mm. He always... I felt like... I knew he was going to be the one mm. to take out. Because he was he was doing that shit for real. Keith? Yeah, he was. <laughs> he, he was doing that shit for real. I DJ Ken. Oh, uh, DJ Ken? Mm -hmm. At that time? Mm -hmm. We used to be going over there. He used to be on... Over there on Blackgate. Mm -hmm. So that's where Ken was at? Over mm -hmm. there on Blackgate? So we always be going over there to the store and shit. But yeah. Sosa was locked in with that shit for real. He, he, he had that presence. You knew he yep, was going to I knew it. <laughs> See, I want to ask you a strong question. Now, it's a tough question I want to ask you. Now, I want to know if you're going to be honest with me now. I wasn't going to ask this, <laughs> but I'm going to ask this because I got you in the chair. I want to be transparent. You know, and it's the question I'm going to ask you without being policy. But I am going to ask you this question. Uh... Why Keith don't come back? Oh, Block ran Keith out. That's a rumor. Nah, that's a rumor. Yeah. Shit, he could come back if he want to come back. He just don't want to come back. Yeah. All that rumors that he ran now, he not welcome no more. That ain't how the people in Old Block feel. That's some internet shit, too. We still love him. Yeah. If he want to come back, he could come back. How is it, though, seeing videos about your neighborhood? Is it everything? You okay no. with it now? Y'all used to it now? This shit be funny sometimes, because... People be on the outside looking in. They don't be knowing what the fuck they be talking about half the time. So, mm -hmm. we just be laughing at that shit. Now, at first, we used to be right. getting irritated, you know, responding back and shit. Now, that shit be like. Right. So, it was a time where that shit was a little bit yeah. too much. Right. <laughs> so, you are aware when you go live, people run into them lives and shit mm -hmm. like that. Yeah. I wanted to know that, though. Can I ask you another question? Why do people cry when they see y'all? When they going there, you know, I seen somebody crying when they came in. No, it was a guy crying. He went, he was crying. He was crying. He was crying, I seen that shit. He was crying in your community. Mm -hmm. I see people catching planes to so come out there. Mm -hmm. You know, I hear people DMing me. They send me DMs. Say, "True, I'm finna go to O Block." I say, "Okay, <laughs> that's dope." You know, what is in O Block that's making people so in love with it? Us. She <laughs> yeah. us. Us as people, they want to vibe, shit. They really want to come get their own view of it. You can't believe everything you see on the internet. Come see for yourself. Mm. It ain't all what they make it seem. It get ugly, but it ain't It ain't like that all the time. Now it's get really ugly. fun. We party every day. Mm. <laughs> it just be fun. Now you said ugly now. Okay, now I kind of want to get back on the ugly. Arguing, fighting, yeah. little shit. I heard a rumor that it's dangerous the moment one of you guys walk out the gate. That's yeah. not true, is that some more internet shit? That's some internet shit. Right. Why do the internet lock in on that community? What's what's going on? <laughs> There's a lot of neighborhoods. Why is the internet on that community? Is this that's where the rap shit came from? Yep. The legends came from over there. Mm -hmm. Vaughn, Sosa, T Roy, HK, Slutty. J Money. You know Slutty too then. Big A. O D. Everybody. These are all guys that I see on your Instagram page. That was my peoples. Why years ago and shit. What? Why did that was my boy? Right. Yeah. 
and all these guys we hear them in rap songs and shit like that man. Mm-hmm. you know i find that crazy though you know some of the people don't understand you know it ain't that i'm just want to just hype it so much but i do find it's amazing that a lot of these guys don't got rap songs but got millions of fans though so, you know um i want to ask you another question in this lane and this is the last question i want to ask you in this lane you're a female I don't ask none of the men this because you know I have a lot of grizzly savages in that chair. You know, okay, <laughs> um, today I got you in the chair, so I'm gonna ask you this: It's a lot of legends in Oakland. You just named a few of them. It's a female out here about two who people say a legend. Some people kind of say her name in a disrespectful way too. Her name Kiva. Mm-hmm. Who is that? Why is y'all calling me? Oh, don't worry, but I gotta get Eddie Gang. I have to edit that out. It's my boy E calling. <laughs> he supposed to be right here with me. <laughs> okay. Uh, we can keep going. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, yeah, I wanna ask you. Um, you say E, that's you say what you don't? Mm-hmm. Oh, that's the legend right there. Are you, oh, okay, yeah. I was okay. gonna bring him as my surprise <laughs> guest. Uh, oh, man, we had to kill that. Uh, look, <laughs> um, okay, I'm gonna get, uh, I got like four more questions on there. Go ahead. Okay. Um, yeah, I want to ask you about that. Kita. Who, who is Kita? That's Nuwap's sister. Oh. Nuwap and Boski's sister. Okay. I ain't trying to get nosy in that. You know, I don't want to, to ring a bell. But I hear her name a lot mm-hmm. in the music and stuff like that. It seemed like it was a lot of love for her and stuff mm-hmm. like that. Yeah. It was a lot of love for her. Mm. Is it weird that people kind of put her name in songs? Yeah, like because that? she went around when a lot of shit kicked off. Like that shit is lame. Mm. But I'm they don't be I don't I ain't heard it in a minute. But yeah, when I did that shit was goofy. Mm. I wanted to ask you. I got a female from Old Block, so that's the reason I asked you. Mm-hmm. Um, Tay, I be seeing your rap in there. Mm-hmm. I see people in your videos. Mm-hmm. You taking this serious? I was at first. So you're not no more? I don't know. Yeah. I feel like I want to, though. Because I got a lot of shit. I got shit I got recorded that I ain't even drop yet. I could drop today if I wanted to. Oh, like. so you do got something in the stash? Mm-hmm. Okay. So why you holding it? You know, I get DMs about you at least once every week, a couple weeks. You know, people DM me about you. It's just too much going on right now. Right. So I'm, I'm chilling. I'm trying to wait till a lot of shit that hell. I'm mm-hmm. straight. Is this rap something you wanted to do, or is the community, the fame from the hood, that that I don't you know. Is? I don't know. I just, one day, like, I want to, I, I got something I need to say. Mm. <laughs> I just woke up one day, like, I need to, I got a lot of shit I need to say. I'm finna go to the stool. Mm. Shit, the I went, I went and did two songs in one day, oh. back to back. You got a video I was going, on mm-hmm. Shot the video, too? To one of the songs. I shot the video to one of the songs I did. But I got I got some old shit though. I ain't dropped yet. Mm-hmm. When you think we're gonna get that? Son, you gonna hold Soon on for a little while like, and shit that yeah, now, then you gonna give yeah. us that? Okay. I ain't even gonna put no sand on it. Okay. I wanted to ask you what you'd be interested in the deal, but it don't seem like you kinda really like on go right now. You kinda like on pause right now. Yeah, but if I was, I wouldn't stand. Why you say that? A lot of people say that. I won't stand. Cause I can do that shit by myself. Right, people say that. Fuck, I need a label to tell me. Nah, I'm doing that shit by myself. Okay, they knock on the door right now, Tay. They got 250,000, couple mixtapes. No. <laughs> yeah, people tell me that. I'm not doing it. Okay, right. Not. To build up your own hype and cool, T-Rays. Yes. Because I could do it. I got people. Right. I know people. My people. You that got shit, a couple songs out? It's going to be up again, so it's mm-hmm. okay. People type your name in. What's the hardest joint you got on YouTube? They type it in right now. What's the hardest song they got? Glockiana. Glockiana. You type in, take out the juice, Glockiana. Yep. Hardest joint. Yeah. I think that's dope. I actually got that queued up on my thing right there, right now. Yes, yes. Uh, Tay, I want to ask you a few more questions. I ain't going to hold you too long. If you had an upcoming artist, a female in this shit, she wants some advice from you. You know a lot of famous rappers. To be honest, I think you're on your way to being a famous rapper yourself. For sure. What would you tell an upcoming artist? Be patient and don't rush. Yeah. Take your time, because that shit going to come. Yeah. For sure. Just stick to it. And don't let nobody get in your ear. Mm. 
move on your time. But I get in your ear, shit, that shit is gonna happen. Yeah. Right. A lot of people gonna be in your ear. I don't think you should. I think you should. No. Yeah. Do what you want. Right. Move on your own time. Don't listen to nobody. <laughs> <laughs> That's all like a baby. People want to get out with you. Where they gonna find you at on all the social media? Tay got the juice. Tay got the underscore juice. T A E G A T T H E underscore juice. What about TikTok? Everything. Because I heard your TikTok was cracking. What about TikTok? I had TikTok? a TikTok. They banned my shit at 16K followers. They banned it? Banned me. Why they do that? <laughs> I was posting too much exclusive shit on that bitch. Uh -huh. In the hey, jungle. Man, flagging they was like flagging that. my shit. Right. That's crazy. You going to get a new one? I got another one already. Okay. What's that TikTok? Because people be liking the TikTok. I think your Brock Young a good song that can be a TikTok. I think I'm trying. Uh, uh, I was on... Um, if you go um type search me up on um TikTok, yeah. you know how you can um see how many. Yeah. My yeah, shit like in a million. Oh yeah. Oh that's dope. If you type in take out the juice on TikTok, okay. Like a million views. Okay. You come back with the same name or you got a different name? No, I got a different name. Okay. It's Juice Lady O six four O six four. Yeah. I think that's dope. What about YouTube? You got your own YouTube channel? I got my own YouTube channel. Take out the juice. Yeah. Y'all got to subscribe to that channel since Tay said she got some music and she unorthodox. She might drop it if she feel in a certain mood. So y'all yeah. need to subscribe right now. I fuck around and start drop. vlogging or something. Yeah, I think you should do that. I could do that. Yeah. You been thinking about that? Mm -hmm. You know what? When I look at your Instagram, that shit look like a I vlog I think I might picture. start vlogging because... <laughs> you got a lot of stories. I got a lot of stories. And it's just a lot of shit I, I know I could talk about. What about you think you can give us a story about Vaughn? Because you knew Vaughn. Vaughn was my boy. I knew Vaughn when he had a Blackberry. You remember <laughs> Blackberry that had the ball in What? If you ain't know Vaughn when he had that Blackberry, you don't know. You don't know. <laughs> For real. He was crazy, though. Did you see him getting to this point? That shit. That's weird. It happened out of nowhere. Like, I was happy as hell, though. What you mean out of nowhere? Because I wasn't expecting for him to be no rapper. Like, right. I wasn't expecting for him to be rapping and shit. But he was raw as fuck. I'm oh, nigga, you should have been. What the fuck? <laughs> fuck was you waiting for all this time? That was my boy, though. Mm. Is it true he used to really come back out there while he was famous like that? What? That's true, though. Yes. Yeah. Walking around, he ain't get no fuck. He want to walk to the store like a regular person. Yeah, he want to walk everywhere that like. Well, he sometimes he he ain't get no fuck about everybody walk, but certain times he come, he let me walk by myself. I want to go. He want to be himself. Like he was, yeah. <laughs> he was aware that he was famous though. Yeah, he was, mm -hmm. but he ain't get no fuck. He still was Vine. Like right. he still was Vine. He ain't let that shit. I miss him though. Mm -hmm. I already was a giver. You know, there's a lot of stories about him that paint him super aggressive, but a lot of people told me he was a giver. Yeah, he was. Mm -hmm. He'll give a motherfucker the shirt off his motherfucker back. I remember one time I was out there. He, damn, you need a haircut. He telling one of the guys, you need it. Here. <laughs> yeah, he $200. Go uh, get your haircut. Yeah. yeah, he was. He didn't get no fuck. He was giving little kids. Mm -hmm. Every time he came, he was giving motherfuckers shit. Every single time. He was, he was giving back. Is it different in the O with them gone? Is it the same? Is it the same? Shit different now, man. Shit different. Yeah. Shit, yeah. Shit different. It ain't the same. Mm. He was having shit in order. Everybody was, you know, happy and shit like. <laughs> Everybody was happy. Mm. Yeah, you know. Long live King Von. For sure. Most definitely. Tay, what's some social medias again? Tay got the underscore juice. T A E G A T T H E juice. And that YouTube channel, what again? Tay got the juice. Okay. And that TikTok, what again? Juice Lady 064064. Uh, I appreciate the opportunity to speak with you. The homie Truth Teller Street Reporter. Bleh, 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 bleh. Uh.